Hello everybody and welcome back to Resident West. Oh my gosh, I've, I've been texting my friend. He already knew about this, but he was like, oh, something's coming and you'll never see it coming. And I was like, oh, like he didn't really say that, but he was just like, something crazy happened. He's like, it's wild. And that was like last week. And I was like, what? And now I'm like, wow, that's crazy. <laughs> I texted him. I was like, wow. Um, anyway, you might also hear in the background yelling children because I am still currently living in a hotel as I have been for the last, you know, eon, uh, aka seven months or so, and there are children in the pool outside and I have a balcony room on the third floor, but it just, it's a horseshoe shape and it all just, all the sound just funnels right up into the rooms. So, anyway, I don't know if, how, how, here we go. Here, here we go. I don't know how to fight a man who I don't, um, I don't, I do not, hang on, no, I, I don't know how to do this, um, I want the electric, where's my freaking trip, not the rope caster, that's not gonna do anything, where is the, not the explosive one, shock trip caster, I don't even know if this will work, but here we go. Also, really quick, let me, he's about to do something. I could see him over there. Um, I want to see, how did I do this? Aim with L2 and fire. Boy, no, 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 no. Um. I wish it didn't have to end uh, this way. Nope, hang on. Fire won't work there. What, you? You and me. Did he just, he just, oh, it didn't, it didn't arm itself. That's cool. That's cool, 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 Okay. I gotta use that console to make it drop more. What do you mean use the console to make it drop more? What do you mean? Oh my gosh. He's too close. Oh, okay, cool, it. that's fine. I just gotta lure him over but all here. Must come to an end. Oh, jeez. Oh, time to go. Okay. Oh, wrong button. I'm like leaning over in my seat. I don't even. Hmm. This kills all mine. I need different weapons. Okay. Here we go. go. Okay. That's not gonna help you, girl. Ooh, it might. Oh, jeez. Should have run, little mouse. Ooh. Ow. I can't even look at him. What are you up to? What do you think, my guy? You should maybe you should maybe pay attention. She hides. I'm not hiding, I'm freaking stuck. I'm stuck on a oh, I'm stuck on a giant I'm stuck on a giant platform. You want this as much as what is what is wrong with you? Psychopath? He is just a psycho. I'm not even looking at you. Oh. Come on! Shoot at me! Nope. Not that rig. Why why he's a moron. He's an he's obviously an idiot. Where did it was it this one? Nope. It was this one. Not that one. Maybe that one. Ow. I can hear him. <laughs> oh my gosh, stop stabbing me. Got Quit fooling around. No. Nope. Oh. I'll give you another chance. No. Did he take it down? No. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my. I was like, I'm just gonna try to run. I'm gonna jump off. Not this again. Ain't gonna help, girl. That guy did it last time in the last game. I didn't like it then. I don't like it now. Come on. 
Don't hit me. Ugh, gotta cut the main stem. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> uh, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. I need to shoot the couple. I, I know, I know, I know, I know. Ow. <laughs> Ow. I don't know what the. What do you mean, the coupling sh shooting the main stem? I don't understand. Oh, okay. Ow. Oh, okay then. Let me taste up. the blood. I need to cut them off. Oh my gosh. It's not the same. It's feeling. Mm -hmm. Hey. Oh my goodness gracious. Power. Oh, 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 oh. oh my goodness. Please stop it. Uh. Okay. <laughs> stop. I don't even know if I'm hitting the right thing. Okay. Uh, looks like there's two more couplings on the stem. Oh my gosh, it's too many. It's too many. You'd think he'd figure it out. <laughs> I can't. He's moving things. Oh my gosh. If that thing comes down, it's only going to kill you. Better than letting you have all the fun. I didn't even get a good look at any of his attacks. <laughs> I was just not looking at him. God damn it! Oh hey, they still use the old phrases. <gasps> they must be cryogenically frozen people like people that were cryogenically frozen or something, and now they're awake. What was that? Me killing what you wanted dead. What the hell did you think? The platform collapsed, body went with it. Oh, he's talking. Mm. Right. And since when don't you get what you want, huh? Spectres, search. I was like, is he talking to me? But no, he's talking to the... On his phone, or whatever. I'm gonna call it. Is this clear? Is it what? Excuse me, pardon? Hmm? It's a clean escape, maybe, is what she was saying, because it wasn't. <laughs> oh, go fast. No, no, no. Give me my... Give me my underwater breather ASAP, please. Yeah, I realize that. I don't see anywhere to fix that here. I'm just really hoping. Okay, yep. Okay. Oh, hi. <laughs> I don't know what to do with that. What's this? Are they gonna swim and follow me? They are 100% gonna swim and follow me. Is that where I came out? Okay, well, here we go. Let's try over here. I don't know where to go. Okay. This one? Can we get out this way? Oh, jeez. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Okay. Oh my god. 
gosh. Silence. I'm so pissed. Silence. How do I get out of here? Bam. Okay. How to get out of here? Yeah, listen, we already we've already gone we've already gone past that. Oh my gosh! Specters aren't giving up. Silence. I don't. I I am I'm going to assume Silence had no idea that they had a clone too, because then he wouldn't bother with me probably, fast. unless he would, because he was like you know. Ooh. Um, because he, it's easier to control me, a known factor. And, you know, he doesn't have any control over the other one. Oh my gosh. What are, what are we doing? I hear them. Usually you guys usually it lets me see through walls. Why isn't it letting me see through the wall? That's upsetting. Ah, <sighs> well. At least I can hear them. If I can get a chance to scan them, I should. I see. Oh, okay. I see. Looks like some kind of power. Ah, oh, what the freak? That scared me. Lead here. Promising. Suits. Oh my gosh! It's the. I, there was something else in this game that reminded me of Andromeda. Was it the? Was it some sort of like? It looked like the vaults. Search for a way out. How? Woo -hoo. Is there any goodies over here? For those intrepid explorers? Nope. Okay. Seriously, I know she won't actually kill Silence, but it'd be really great if we if we could. Although, to be fair, in the last game, you had the choice to kill like the big baddie or to let him go, or to imprison him or something. On my most recent time through, I chose to kill him. The perfect. Too, nope, it's too good to be true. Too good to be true. Oh boy. You better just go. She does this a lot. She, she seems to have this issue. Oh, just literally, we're gonna fall into the water where power sources, we would be electrocuted. This is why you shouldn't just blow things up, Aloy. Because <laughs> there's consequences to your actions. Oh, oh, oh that's all. Oh. See, this is why friends are nice. They help you when this happens. Oh, we're hallucinating. And I'm wearing his armor right now. Cool. That's for two it is. <gasps> oh, now this is now this is weird. Now it's dad complex. I've, I've got it. Is Gaia? Did Gaia get wet? Also, like that's the thing, right? Did the Gaia see. Hey, hey, easy, easy there. Hey, 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 hey! It's right here. Okay. Mm. The way you were clutching it when I found you, I knew it was important. Where are we? An outpost of the Utaru tribe, not far from where you fell. How long? Two days. Uh, 
Hey, we're both wearing the same symbol. Aloy. There's no time. I found something. In the mountains west, west of Plains Song. Yeah. Kept muttering it while I carried you. Look, Aloy, whatever it is that you found, you're in no shape. To... I will crawl if I have to. Fight. Okay, fine. But before you do that, there's someone you should talk to. An Utaru named Zo. She told me there's been trouble in those mountains. A cave spitting out deadly machines. Can't be a coincidence, right? Why do we need her? Let's head for the cave. It's in Utaru territory. Her territory. She can help us. You'll see. See, Aloy? Even Elizabeth Sobek needed help to make Gaia and the sub functions. As verdant limbs wither, roots rot in snow, still the seed rises as certain as stone. So? She should be in bed. Aloy doesn't really do shit. <laughs> You're so right. Verl said I should talk to you about the machines in the mountains west of Plainsong. I am a grave singer. My place is here. We can talk once you've healed. What's wrong with it? Her. The name is Ray, not it. She's one of our land gods, and she's dying. Not just dying. She's suffering. Her condition is not your concern. So, if anyone can help, it's Aloy. May I? So what I'm about to do might look bad, but it will help. Spear. We gonna stab it. Oh, this is the worst I've ever seen her. It looks really cool. <laughs> Faro likes her. No, no. <laughs> I still need to talk. I actually don't know that, but of course. But this way, just looking at her doesn't mean anything. <laughs> the mountains. West of Plainsong. There's trouble out there? The Utaru have trouble everywhere. Our fields blighted, our settlements abandoned. But the cave in the mountains is the worst of it. It is a sacred place. Fa, another of our land gods, went inside weeks ago, but she hasn't emerged. Killer machines pour out instead, threatening to overwhelm us. It's never happened before. Wouldn't be your first sacred cave. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> um, blah, blah, blah. You said the tribe has trouble with its fields and settlements. Yes. Whereas once the land gods harvested endless bounty from the fields, now they sow a poisonous blight. Oh, shoot. War brews among the Tanakh, so their rebels prowl our outskirts. And the machines grow ever more aggressive, hemming us in, forcing us to desert distant villages. Now they're even coming out of our sacred cave. Many in the tribe fear our days are dwindling. Wish I could tell you it was better everywhere else. Not that we're going to lose hope. Oh, oh, I 
I've lost him. Yep, he's not mine. It's cool, it's fine. Oh, uh, Aloy. I'm glad Aloy at least feels some... something for that. Man. <laughs> Varl really was my favorite. Dang it, freak. Dang it. Thanks for taking us in. Varl's the one that carried you across the wilds. I doubt anyone else here would have let us in. Or stayed by my side to make sure Aloy was comfortable. We were lucky to find you. I could say the same thing. Sounds like you two have been spending a lot of time together. I wish it hadn't taken an injury to make that happen. I hope you feel better. And soon. I'm just gonna go cry in a corner now. It's fine. Ray and other machines like her, you call them gods? Land gods, yes. For generations, they provided for us. Seeding and harvesting the fields of Plainsong. Food for all. A miracle of endless bounty. A farm. Run by machines. More than a farm. A blessed land. Providing sustenance for my people. Until the derangement. So what happened to the land gods after the derangement? They faltered. Year by year. Once they were peaceful, now they turn on us when we approach, even attack us. They'd always enrich the soil, but for several seasons they've glutted it endlessly with mulch. The fields have turned fetid. A blight that keeps spreading, even beyond our lands. Oh, so the blight came from here. We used to have food for all. Now we... We barely have enough to feed our children. Must be... Over-fertilization. Spread by spores, maybe? I don't know. That's not even the end of it. Each land god used to visit the sacred cave once a year, but no longer. Without the rituals of renewal, they've fallen apart. Like Ray. They're dying. And my tribe with them. So the cave is sacred because machines like Ray and the one you call Fa go inside? Yes. Before the derangement, each land god left the fields and made a pilgrimage to the cave. Always in the same order. Doe first. I knew it. Me, I knew it. And me and <laughs> so on. Do re mi fa so la ti do. Each reappeared two days later, shining anew, without so much as a scratch. All soil and ornaments of worship washed away. The tribe celebrated each return as one of the eight hallowed festivals of our calendar. But the derangement changed the cycle. Yes, or so we thought. Over time, the land gods stopped the ritual, becoming crazed and brittle. But three weeks ago, Fa trudged inside. The entire tribe lifted their voices in song, praying that the cycle had begun again. Fa has not emerged. What has our machines built to kill? Are machines being made inside? Like in a cauldron? Sounds like it. But the way these... Land gods come and go. It's not like anything I've seen before. I was, I was, in, she said Ray and Fa, and I was like, no way. And then apparently <laughs> it is. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Yep, that's eight. Oh, wow. That's hilarious. Also, apparently their culture is big on singing because she's got this grave singer position, and also their gods are named after. Eight music notes. <laughs> you called yourself a grave singer. What does that mean? To all living things, an end must come. It is my task to ease the passage. I try to bring comfort and sing of the renewal that death sows the way for. But I never thought I would have to sing for one of our land gods. I don't even know if Ray hurt me. What you did soothed her more than I ever could. 
It's not your fault, so. And without the second sight, there's nothing more you could have done. I am gonna cry. <laughs> I need to get into that cave. What? No one does that. Well, it's time to make an exception. It belongs to the land gods, Luxo. There is something inside there. Something that could solve problems all over the world. The storms, the derangement. <laughs> Maybe even your broken land gods. What could possibly do all that? A spirit? Yeah. Something like that. I could journey back to Plainsong. Assemble the chorus. Tell how you soothed Ray. Ask their permission to go inside. Great. I'll get my things. She needs rest. You don't have to tell me. Okay, I'm fine. Assembling the chorus will take time. Heal first, then join me. Fine. Bed rest. I got it. Wouldn't want to get in the way or anything. Don't mind me. I'll just have my broken ribs and leg over here. She I does not need you to help her heal. You could come with me to plain song. Lend your voice to mine as I try to persuade the chorus. It might help her cause. I'd like to. But I'm afraid she might. I, I am still awake. I am right here. Really? Very well. Later then. So, wait. It's not uh, that I don't want to go with you. It's just that I... I am... Oh, well, okay. There goes that. It's fine. I'm just gonna... I'll be happy for him. Is that what you were trying to say? Um. Yes. This is actually really mean, honestly, of the developers. <laughs> then I look forward to more conversation. This is really mean. Uh. Yeah. Me too. You can't just dangle Varro in front of me and then take him away like this. <laughs> You're supposed to be resting. Varro. You should go with her. I'll get better on my own. You trying to get rid of me so you can... <laughs> no. Not this time. I'll meet up with you in plain song when I'm ready. You sure about this? Yes. Go. <laughs> get out of here. Okay. So, wait. Well, I'm really sad. Honestly. <laughs> Just really sad. Who are they? Like, I wasn't necessarily expecting romance options available for Aloy, but Varro was like making eyes at me in the first game, and now I've lost him, which is fair because Aloy's been pushing him away, and this Utaru lady's really nice, and she's really pretty, and she really vibes well with him, I think, but still. I'm still sad. Okay. Well, How long did that take? Oh. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> now that just leaves Erin of the two that are supposed to be friends. I honestly thought that we were, like, from what I saw in some of the promotional material, I thought they were supposed to hang out with us more. Like, come be companions with us. Erin and Varl. And maybe we'll get to that point, but it's still, like, not there yet. <laughs> And now I feel bad. Now I'm going to be holding him back from his, like, you know, true love from another land. But, oh, man, freaking, oh, and Vinasha, she's freaking with Erlin, what's it, no, what's his name? I can't remember. That old guy who's also attractive. Okay, no, you know what? This is, you know, this is pushing me towards, it's pushing me towards, um, Avad. That's what it's doing. 
<laughs> I'm just I'm just speculating. I'm sorry. This game is not a romance game. It's not an RPG and I'm not going to be able to romance people, but it was nice in the first game having, you know, a variety of people that, you know, <laughs> could <laughs> that you could kind of flirt with and or um just be like, "Oh, they're making eyes at you." But realistically, people looking just somebody looking at you doesn't mean <laughs> that they're going to freaking fall in love with you. Petra maybe but i wonder because i i truly do and this is a tangent but like i really do enjoy games that have a tighter narrative structure um sometimes the open-ended like you know your decisions matter and like change everything blah 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 it can be a bit too open-ended we were discussing this in my discord the other day whereas so sometimes when i see like your decisions matter as like a marketing ploy i get nervous because that means things are a little too open-ended or too <sighs> Like, the narrative can't really have the same impact it would as if, like, some of the story beats, like, more of the story beats were more, like, you know, consistent. Um, so. AKA, this is me saying, if the game's pushing me towards a VOD, I don't mind. <laughs> but it's also me saying other things, too, like, right? Where, like, if they gave me the chance, like, the choice to romance, it might be a little weird. It might throw things off. And, again, not leave a tight enough narrative structure you know, for like a good story. Um, anyway, I'm just gonna go cry in a corner. I'm just, it's, I'm, I'm heartbroken. Thank you all for watching. <laughs> and I want to really quick say thank you to my patrons. Thank you, patrons. Thank you all so much, but especially to my sapling tier patron, Reese Galito. Thank you so much. And my tree tier patron, Christopher. Thank you so, so much for all your support. I really appreciate it. Thank you all again for watching. I'm going to go cry now. Goodbye.